it's a neck-to-neck -neck battle for Sierra Leone's top job. There are 13 presidential candidates, but the race front-runners are incumbent President Julius Madabio from the Sierra Leone's People's Party, who is seeking re-election. And his main challenger is opposition candidate Samura Kamara of the All People's Congress Party. Well, I want to appeal to everybody, we want peaceful election. On Wednesday, security forces dispersed opposition protesters who were accusing the Electoral Commission and its chairman Mohamed Kone of alleged bias in favor of the ruling party. Protesters were also demanding the release of a more detailed voters register. We are here to protest because we want a credible election. All we are asking for, we don't have problem with the government of the day. We just want a credible election. If the elections are free and fair, definitely there will be no protest. On the campaign trail, Mother Bio promised to expand access to public education and increase agricultural production. While former finance minister Samura Kamara promised to address economic shortfalls and restore national solidarity. Sierra Leoneans have been facing a crippling economic crisis, massive unemployment and high food and fuel prices. We not get a fix of economy, the economy to poor in the country. Don't we they suffer? Because like we they do business, so if we go right now for go buy business, everything they up. The water keep rise expensive. We not get nobody where they talk for we. In the last election in 2018, Beyond narrowly defeated Kamara with 51.8% of the votes in the runoff. Honestly, the momentum, the appetite for people to come out and vote is bigger than ever before in Sierra Leone today because people are tired of this, of this regime. They want to see change. The regime change is not coming from Samura Kamara. It's coming from the people. It's not coming from the development partners, it's coming from the people. But it won't be an easy ride for the winning candidate. He'll have to face the difficult task of driving down the cost of living. Bishra Göktaş, TRT World.